suspects who happen to be star athletes. The victim on your screen right here, 24 year old Connor Mediate. The two guys charged are Jonathan Murray and Cameron Walker, a surprise to students who just saw them last night at the basketball game. CBS 46's Savannah Louie live in Alpharetta tonight with more on reaction. Savannah. Yeah, they're shocked for a couple of different reasons. First, that this could happen here in their community. And second, that it's these two boys who could be involved. They're relatively well liked by folks at school and they're facing some disturbing charges. The fact that I knew them and I like passed them in classes like every day really freaked me out. How do you understand the unbelievable? Very Everybody was talking about Very it. stressful, yeah, like, very... Every single um, class you went to, you could like hear someone or another talking about Milton High School students lean on one another as classmates 17-year-old Cameron Walker and 18-year-old Jonathan Murray sit in jail. The pair taken into custody after winning their high school basketball game Wednesday night, charged in connection with the murder and attempted robbery of 24 year old Connor Mediati. Oh, my football friends is even like I gave him a hug like two days ago. And I didn't even know and like people were talking about how crazy this they hit it so well. You know, these kids are 17 and 18 years old. I mean their life is done over over some really just a really poor decision. According to arrest warrants, Walker coordinated a drug deal with Mediati over Snapchat. Mediati thought he was selling drugs to Walker, but other Snapchat conversations reveal Walker was planning to rob him. When they met at the Collingwood Apartments, Mediati was shot and killed. Social media, cell phone data, and other evidence connected Walker and Murray to the murder. You may think it disappears. Nothing disappears. It's always there, and it's always there for life. Investigators say it's not clear who pulled the trigger. Very sad for the families, you know, and very sad for their team. Because, I, you know, like it was really stressful for some of the players on the team just to find that out. Now, one of those suspects, Cameron Walker, was a recruit for a Division I basketball team at George Mason. Uh, we know that the head coach for that team even called him, quote, one of those feel-good stories. Now, I did just hear from the university who tells me that Walker has been dropped from the program. Reporting live from Alpharetta, Savannah Louis, CBS 46 News. Thank you, Savannah.